Welcome guys, it is the Axeman here and we are back on Oxford Evolved with some more Tribe Wars, yeah boys! So last episode we went off the rails a bit, we went a little bit crazy and we decided to uh, rob the bank. Steal all the stuff from the bank and then uh, we got chased down, we got captured, we got killed. And the Swamp Tribe, they, they didn't like that. They didn't like that they had a convicted criminal within their ranks, so they kicked me out. Yeah, imagine that. They kicked out me for trying to steal them some loot. So, uh, we now have to find ourselves a new um, a new tribe to join um, and stuff. So, I've been here praying to the Dodo God. Hopefully, they find me a new tribe. And um, I think my prayers have been answered. So, uh, we was in talks with the Cave Tribe. I, f I, I don't know why, I just knew they would have me... Um, they, I don't know if they're short on people or what not, but they, they were like, yeah, sure, you can come along, join us and stuff. So I got Kevin back. He didn't die. Luckily, I went and game today and he was still alive, which is, uh, which is sweet. So we are going to go uh, down there because they live under the town. And uh, we're going to check out the base, um, see what they've got. And then I don't know where else this episode goes. We'll probably just check out the base, see what it looks like. Um, I don't know, test the creatures out, check out the gear and stuff. And then next episode we can go into a cave and tame some creatures. Because I really want to tame, like, I don't know, a spider or a balsam. Imagine that. Do they have them in caves on this, on Ragnarok? I'm trying to think what caves actually have creatures in. I actually can't remember, Renna. <laughs> uh, they have Megalanias in the one below us in Megalosaurus. Um, I wonder if they cleared out the spiders in the... In the castle? I actually don't know. Oh, actually, yeah, before then, before we do anything, uh, Kevin, leave your fat ass. Uh, if you do enjoy the video at any point, don't forget to smash thumbs up button, subscribe, ring the bell, and enable notifications. All the support is so much appreciated. Uh, also, go ahead and follow the Twitter, the Instagram. When this video is out, with, uh, I think we're over in America, so there'll be stuff being posted up soon. You can keep, in, uh, keep up with what's actually going on and stuff like that. Uh, and all of that's appreciated and stuff as well. So we're gonna go down here. It's gonna be dark as well So that's gonna be great. Can we like make a torch or something? What do I need for that stone flint wood? Can we get some of that stuff? Okay, there we go. We just knocked a croc out. So obviously we're not allowed to tame it But uh, good old Kevin and being able to knock stuff out. Okay, so we should be able to get through here then and then we won't be attacked. Oh, can I even close this gate from this way? We shouldn't be attacked by the, um, the, what are they called? What are the, the thingies called? The plant species X, that's it. <laughs> we shouldn't be attacked by that. Can I close this gate? Is this gate not closed from this side? Are you freaking kidding me? Yeah, quick, get back on. Okay, let's go. So I'm not sure if there's any, like, sarcos or bionics here. So I'm just kind of going to jump through real quick. There we go, there's the cave tribe. So that's where we are going to be living now. Oh, there was a creature. Stupid Dimorphodon. Okay, so let's see what we've got here. So this is going to be our front entrance. There's a couple of creatures here already. That's cool. Uh, I'm just going to go ahead and shut this. We're going to load in in a minute and it's going to be all uh, frame us. What have we got? We've got Azul the Pachyrhinosaurus. We've got a Capro. Got a frog. Okay. So we've got some like nice looking gates there, which is pretty cool. And then we've just got to run all the way down here, because if I remember correctly, there's a little bit of a run. Now it's gonna load in the cave now, so a little bit of uh, frames and stuttering and stuff. Is it loading in? I think oh I think we're all good. Probably all good. So yeah, we'll go like all the way down. We're gonna be one of them people that live underground now. It's gonna be pretty crazy. Yeah. And green, green light is going to be a thing, apparently. This is going to be a, a different experience to living now, living underground rather than uh, in the swamp. So here's a part of the base. Oh, wow. Look at the rock drake just chilling there. So what is this, then? Is this just the marketplace? Like, I've not really explored the base. We saw a bit of it in the, uh, in the video, so we can have a look around. Ha! Huh, this is cool. What is this? A fish stool. <laughs> so this is all from the uh, the eco mods. That's really cool looking. I really like that. Look at the little angler f anglerfish. <laughs> That's really cool. Little trilobites there. Got some scuba. Got some fur. What is this? 
food store. There's some cages there. Is that a turkey? Frank the turkey. Yo, what up, Frank the turkey? How you doing? Sweet, I want to check out their tent. Look at that, they got a freaking rock drink. Do they have different decorations on it? Oh, they do. Ugh, look at the bat one. What the shit? That looks creepy. Was the one? Oh, man. Nope. Nope, nope, nope. We're going to stick with the rock drink. That's really cool looking. It's a really cool color as well. It's like pinky purple. So that's the, uh, their, um, what are they called? Subterranean tribe tent. There we go. So this looks like this is their maybe, uh, place where they store stuff and sell stuff, maybe. Uh, oh, got some eggs here as well. Egg and kibble. Like, is there stuff in here? No, there's not. Okay. What else do we got? What is this? Food keeper? <gasps> there's a rock drake egg in there. That's cool. Oh, here's the rock drake tent. This thing is freaking amazing. So as you can see, like, its eyes randomly glow. That is really cool. What? Where is this mist coming from? Is this just general cave mist? So this is there. What is this called? The concave tent? Yeah, this is concave tent. Oh, look how everything's like just so, I don't know, organized and neat. This is really neat. I really like this. They've done a really good job in like decorating this place. Yeah, I love that. That is so cool. I mean, the swamp one was cool with like the spino school, but that rock drake one is just straight up madness. So that's the little like store area, it looks like. And then I uh, believe if we press on up here, we should reach like the actual cave cave. Who's Gummy Worm? <laughs> they have a snake called Gummy Worm. Hey, Gummy Worm. I'm your, your new friend. So what do we have? So it looks like, yeah, just both ways we can go. Uh, got another, another tent thing. So got a car. No, don't think we can go down there. Let's maybe not go that way. Let's go up this way. We've got a beaver. I'm just going to follow the green. Okay, we've got two ways. Let's go this way first then. So we've got all the cat pros. This is the other tent. This has, I don't know what that's meant to be. I don't know, like, and I've seen the, the mask or the helmet and it has this same design. It's really cool looking though, and I'm not sure what it is. Does this have a, oh, you know what? I didn't check the sound in the Rock Drake one because all of the, all of the uh, tents seem to have a weird, like, ambient sound when you're in them. Let's see if this one does. Hmm, just general cave noise. Someone sleep here. Hey! Hey, wake up! Wake up! Hey! Hello! Wake up! Look, there's the weird helmet. It's really cool looking. We have to go and get ourselves one of them and some armor and stuff. So, oh, we've got some saddles here. What is happening? Okay. <laughs> They're all going to sleep. Is it morning time? It must be. So, here's their saddles. So, can't remember if we uh, explained this before. So, every tribe's saddles have a unique ability. So the swamp one was for the circle and the iguanodon you could hold your breath for like forever pretty much underwater. The cave tribes you don't get uh, aggroed onto from any cave creature. So we can go into a cave and arthropods, spiders, uh, bats and all that, like, they won't aggro to us. So you can just walk straight through unless you attack them and stuff. So this is the trike saddle. So we've got uh, some boxes, got a little arthropora. Looks like a, a box, uh, a box, uh, some rocks or something. It's a little bone in his mouth. <laughs> it's really cute. He's got some crystals. It's, uh, it looks like he's got loads of stones and stuff just chilling on there. He's got a little spider, which is gross. A little pickaxe. What did they call him? Bubblegum or something? Or Bluebra? <laughs> That's cute. Let's see the Carnivore one, because Carnivore one is pretty cool. So, same ability as well. Uh, you're hidden from most wild cave creatures unless you attack or dismount. What have we got on the back there? Oh, that's a Megalosaurus. He looks all flat and stuff. So we've got Crystal. I love the little Crystal Mohawk we've got on him. How freaking cool is that? Like, we look badass. And we glow and stuff. Were you the one that was chasing me? Were you the one that was chasing me yesterday? I feel like you might have been. Um, so that's them. Oh, we can tame Megalosaurus now. We've. I'm so taming one of these. Sleepy dinos! Wake up! Oh, man. I love that. I love that so much. You go back to sleep. I was just joking. You can go to sleep. Um, go to sleep. Aww, that's so cute. Uh, there is some around here. There is, uh, yes, there is some of these in this cave, so we can probably go and tame one of them maybe the next episode or Megalania. Do definitely want to 
have a look at taming some of them. Oh man, I can't freaking wait! I want myself a sleepy dino! Let's keep looking around, see what else we've got then. That guy's staying awake, bless him. <laughs> God, they have so much stuff, like, I'm so gonna get lost. It looks like everyone's got their own little uh, cave tent. That's pretty cool. Is that the bed? Oh, that's the bed. Okay, here's the, uh, is this how we make all the stuff? Oh, it is. Okay, so what, uh, oh man, we're gonna have to make one of each of these helmets. We're gonna try them all out. Uh, did we make that last one? We did not. Let's try them all out first, and then, um, we'll have a look at all the other stuff in a minute. This, this is the main, the main stuff, obviously. Um, so we'll take that off. So they've got the chief, the warrior one, and then just the general tribe one. Let's go for the general tribe one, because that looks hideous. Oh my god. <laughs> that is the creepiest, horriblest looking thing I've ever seen in my life. <laughs> oh my god, that is so gross. I hate the roll rat. I think it's so freaking ugly. It looks horrible. Oh man, you must really love the roll rat to have to wear that. Oh god. Uh, let's go for the warrior one then. Damn. That looks pretty hot. That is pretty cool. I wish... I don't know if that is even based off a creature, if it's just a, a scary rock creature, but if that was a creature, that'd be terrifying. That'd be really cool to add. A little, like, cave modded creature or something. Damn, that thing's cool. I like that one. And then we have the chief one. Hmm. I think I like that other one. The warrior one looks the best. That one's, like, nose is, like, pushed up. Yeah, I think we're definitely gonna go with the warrior one. That's badass. That one's really cool. So we'll stick with that one. That's gonna be a helmet. Uh, so we have a bug on a stick, uh, that's just a torch, so that, we've seen them torches. Their flag's pretty much the same as the swamp one. They have a roll rat sleeping bag, which is disgusting. <laughs> they have the chief head with a megalosaurus, their stools are mushrooms. Um, then they have a food keeper with a rock drake egg, so we've seen most of this stuff already. We've not seen this. Chip away stone to find pet, uh, petrified wood slowly over time. Can be used as natural wood to cr what? Huh. So you can... If you put stone away in here, if you put stone in there, it turn, turns it into wood? That's a, that's a cool thing. I may have to make one of them. If we can go grab some stone, we'll make one of them and see what that's like. So we need to get, um... Oh, you need it to make this. Oh. Okay, yes, yeah, so we need to go out and get some... Oh, no, they have one here. I'm just going to borrow that just so we can have a look what it looks like. Let's pop it here a sec. Okay, so if I popped this... No, I need stone, damn it. What did I just do with my stone? Um, we only have six stone. So there's a chisway stone to fire pet fire wood slowly over time, which can be used as natural wood to craft and build. I wonder how long that takes. Oh, there we go. Stone-like wood has all the properties of a chunk of wood. Huh. That's cool. <laughs> That's crazy. Okay. Uh, I'll pick that back up and pop it in there. Ooh. Oh. Did I miss one? Oh yeah, we had six, didn't we? Okay. That's that's really cool. I like that. So you can have that back. So then we just got the tents and stuff. All right. We definitely need to go and maybe just find one that no one's using. Uh, there's like a whole bunch of them. We can find one and just call it our home. I mean, this place, their base is so big. How am I meant to... How am I meant to remember where everything is? <laughs> oh, what's this? Yo. Oh, this is their fabricator. Oh, damn, there's a lot of silica pearls. They have been collecting them. Oh, they, there is armor in that. Oh, I ain't gonna take it because I want to, like, earn my keep first. Oh, I will take a hatchet, though. I will definitely give it back at some point. A hatchet would just help me out a lot. And then what's all this? Just ammo and stuff. Okay. Uh, you're not Kevin. Kevin? How do you like your new home, Kevin? Do you like it all cavey and stuff? It's just like, they're like set up like shops and stalls and stuff. This is epic. I like this. What have we got in here? Got some eggs, some jerky and stuff. 
some dyes, saddles, got a little kitchen. Oh, they do have. Oh, damn, they've got all the bait. Oh, mate, taming is going to be easy. Do they have the little journal anywhere? So we can look and how to tame stuff. Uh, I don't know. I never crafted one before, so I don't know. Uh, taming journal, okay. We can grab one. All right, we don't have to put it down. You can just have it on your person. Oh, sweet. Um, so what are we looking for? Megalosaurus and the Megalanias, because they live here. So Megalania, don't need combat. Sweet, don't need combat for any of them. And they just eat meat. Nice. Okay, that's cool. What's this? Oh, sorry. I just opened and shut your cave, your, your tent. I may steal this tent. It's, what is that? Why is there a trike pushing in here? This is adorable. Can I borrow this cave? I'm going to rename this to mine. Uh, rename bed. Axe bed. With some caps and some not caps. <laughs> I'll have this as my temporary tent. Everyone stay in my room. Why can't I shut it anymore? Hello? There we go. No one be in my room. That's where I'm going to sleep. Alright, let's see what else we've got then. Just so I know what's going on in my way around and stuff. What is... What the shit? Oh, you can... Ch I didn't know we had this. You can have this as different... What? Volcanic. Arid. Oh, bro, what the hell? Forest bone. Everglades. Oh, I did not know this. What the hell? Damn, okay. That's really cool. Uh, can you stop eating? There's nothing on the floor. What are you even eating? This is the carno breeding area, I'm guessing. I'm guessing it's where they do all the breeding. We've got loads of trikes. Probably need to go out and tame a trike somewhere as well. So the cave uh, biomes obviously is caves and then the outside of caves. So, you know, a kind of rendered distance outside a cave, you can go and tame some of it. So if we ever do want to try, we can do that. Might take a Kano out. Okay, for some reason I thought I saw a Rock Drake. I did not. <laughs> uh, okay, so that's down that bit. I mean, they, they wouldn't mind us taking... Well, I mean, I'll stay on Kevin for now. Um... Well, I'm gonna, I'll tell you what, I'm going to go out. I'm going to get myself a bow and stuff. Um, you know, get get some tools. What is this? Megalania storage. Get yourself some tools and stuff. Oh, God, this is scary. I don't know where I am now. Oh, there's, there's a Megalania. Oh, I can't see if that's a wild one, though. Is that a Megalosaurus as well? I'm scared. I'm going to go back. At least we know where the one is if I need to tame it. Okay, yeah. As I keep saying, I keep getting completely distracted because this is all new and crazy to me now. Um, <laughs> we'll go ahead, um, find a way out of here. So I'm not really sure how I get out. Uh, we'll go make a bow, get some more stuff so we're not, like, stealing off them. And then I think I'm going to real quick run back to the swamp. And because I did leave a lot of stuff there, I may just try and sneak in and steal some of my stuff back. I don't believe any of them are online, so we may be good. So, because I'm, I'm pretty sure I left my Mastercraft gun there or my Ascendant gun and completely forgot to pack it up and stuff. And I kind of really want that. Um, apart from that, I don't really need to take anything else. And I'm pretty happy to join the cave tribe, I'm not going to lie. I'm glad they let me in. Uh, cause I am a, I'm a criminal now. We did rob that bank and, uh, kind of regret it. <laughs> we didn't come away with anything. Okay, the worst thing about being the, with the cave tribe is I have to leave through the swamp. Now these Rexes, <gasps> oh God. Okay. Wow. We just like crashed in as well. Nina. Um, Kevin, help me please. Kevin, come on. I'm going to die. I didn't have uh... Okay, thanks, Kevin. <laughs> I was going to say, um, yeah, we have to leave for the swamp. And I was going to say, we do have battle rexes, which I think are uh, dragons. I think she put them here, I'm not sure. But they're doing a very good job. Um, so, yeah, that's going to be fun leaving every time if we get attacked by a freaking cat, bro. 
Jeez, it's so bright out here. We go down to Gamma 3. Coming out of the swamp. Oh, there's a snake. Coming out of the swamp. Oh, we could probably tame that if we wanted. Coming out of the swamp and then, uh... Oh, God. Snake, can you go away? Because I need to shut this door. Yeah, coming out of the cave and then coming into light is weird. Oh, yeah, of course you're getting stuck now. I'll knock you out. I will. I'll do it. I did it to that Sarko. I'll knock you out. Stupid. Look, you all unconscious and stuff. So... The cave tribe. Oh, look at that Pachysa uh, Pachysaurus. The Pachycephalosaurus. Freaky colour. So the cave tribe now. Hmm. I like the sound of it. We've got to travel all the way over there to get to the old swamp base, though. This is going to be fun. It's going to be fun travelling to get there rather than, like, travelling to get there to go home type of deal. I wonder if the cave has a boat. Definitely should have a boat down here that could be docked up. Unless they've got one somewhere else. Hmm... Do I want to attempt to jump across there? Do I think I could jump across there with the horse? Probably not. It's probably better to walk around, ain't it? I just know there's going to be Microraptors, and I know they're going to be a pain in my asshole. You know, I've just realised, even if I do get into the base, I never unlocked the smithy. So I am legit going to have to wait for a tribe, like a swamp tribe member to come on. There's definitely none on right now. Uh, it's really early morning. I never record this earlier. Like, ever. I'm just, like, getting these videos all out and ready for when I'm away. So, definitely all's going to be on until, I don't know. I don't even know if I'm going to be able to get my gun back. The only thing I could do... What, okay, there's a Rex. The only thing I could do is, like, admin the smithy to mine, but then I can't give it on back, and I feel like that's a dick move. Are you coming for me? Do you want to go? I feel like Kevin can handle you. Bring it, Mr. Rex! Definitely can't tame you, but I can still knock you out if Kevin can beat you up. Come on, Kevin. Knock him out. You're an expert at this stuff. Okay, it's fine. I want it to be... Oh, it's a 162. Okay. That's interesting. Uh, let's just make sure I've got some stamina to run away if I need to. That's it. Poop it out. He's coming back. No, he's not. Here he is. Maybe. Who knows what he's doing right now. Cave tribe ain't afraid of no Rex and Carno at the same time. Getting a little bit hurt. Okay, yeah, that's it. You fight each other. Okay, maybe they don't. Yeah, they are fighting each other. Ha, <laughs> stupid. I really want to knock this Rex out. Come on. Come on, Kevin. You can do it. Show the world. Show the whole of YouTube that you can do it. So I'm actually getting a bit hurt. I do need to run away. <laughs> do need to run away a little bit. That's it. Poop, 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 poop. Get that stamina up. It's coming back. Come on. Kevin, you're a beast. Remember that. Don't let anyone tell you otherwise. If you can knock a Rex out by just kicking it, you're amazing. You're actually really hurt. You know what? Not going to happen. Not going to happen. You're actually really out of stamina as well, so let's maybe not do that. <laughs> we'll just slowly limp off and walk away. That was a bad idea. You're not going to be able to catch me, right? Nah, stupid Rex. Too slow. I feel like he would have gone out sooner or later. Would have probably got him. Um, okay, so what we're going to do then. Let me head back up to the cave tribe. The cave base. Ah, of course, there's a corner there. Damn it. Why did I injure myself finding Rex for no reason? Eh. Okay, Rock, that's fine. You just hold my progression up this hill. Um, we'll get back in the cave tribe then. Um, we'll probably decorate the, our tent a little bit then, as we're not going to go to Swamp Tribe and then we can call it a day, and we'll do all the taming, uh, tomorrow. Right, home sweet home is what we're going to call it now. It's, it's really weird. It's really weird living in a cave now. It's also green and stuff, just going to cook a sheep as well. <laughs> Look at that poor sheep's face. He's like, oh, help me. I'm on fire. So, yeah, this is going to be our little tent. Uh, we're going to live right next to where they breed the carnos and stuff. And just seem to breed all the aloes. They have a lot of aloes. Um, we definitely need to um, kind of maybe start, I don't know, send, not send, what's the word? Trading for spinos or something. I feel like spinos are a must for most tribes now. After seeing them perform well against us uh, for the fly tribe in the war and the, the dino battles. I feel like we definitely need to get some of them for this tribe. Um, so I'm going to make this then for ourselves. Uh, is that going to fit in here anywhere? Oh, what the shit? Whoa, why is it all like... Si why is it upside down? What is happening? Uh, I just wanted it like... 
but here, why can I not place it? What? Okay, I'm gonna. I may have to. You know what? Screw it. Can we have it out here? I wanted it as a bookshelf, but that's fine. Can I have it like next to it? Kevin, you, you're kind of in the way, mate. Gonna have to just move you a sec. There we go. That's better. We can just place that like, like that. Is that cool? That looks cool to me. Look at this. Look at the little feather light just chilling on top. What are you doing up there, bro? Are you eating a human? That's definitely a human skull. All right, so I kind of want. There's one of them next to the base already. Do want to make a stool? We've got a bed in there already. Do we have a torch? I think we need spark powder for that. Uh, we've got torches there. They'll do. Why are you not lit? <laughs> we need them all lit. Uh, I do want to make a little mushroom stool and sit on it because that thing looks freaking adorable. Um, can we have that next to the fire? Okay, oh, then we make the. Uh, let's have it like turn around. So if I sit on that now, my face in there. Sweet. Okay, can we make the bug on a stick? Because we used to have a slug. Uh, how much wood? Five wood. Sweet, we can. That's all my petrified wood. And now we can cook this when we sit down and eat. Mmm. Delicious, I can't quite see. We got a little dung beetle just uh, roasting up there. How cute is that? Look at me just sat on like a little mushroom. I feel in such a form so small. I'm such a short ass. Mmm. Delicious dung beetle. <laughs> oh no! The fire just went out. Did I do that? Uh oh. I've got no, no wood left in there. Oops. Uh, I do have though. Oh wait, why was I making a noise? I'm gonna put a hundred stone in there. And that should change to this wood and stuff. That's pretty neat. And then I'm um, also. Can, how do we place that? There we go. I want to place this down here, so I can come in and read it when we need stuff. So I do want to have a look at taming these and stuff. So they can be immersive tamed. They need raw meat, spoiled meat bait. Uh, what about the bats? I feel like having the bats would be really cool. What are they freaking called? Uh, an onic? On, on, on. Onic. Why has it got the face of a... Uh... Oh, damn, what are they called? A uh, seeker. Ain't that what a seeker's face is? Um, okay, so we can tame them as well. Okay, this is going to be interesting. Can we shoot off the back of a... Uh... A carno or a trike. Okay, we can't shoot off the back of you. Uh, have we got any trikes here I can just see? I can't remember if we can or not. Can't shoot off the. Oh, we can shoot off the back of the trike. Okay, so it looks like we're going to be taking a trike and finding a cave it can fit into to tame a, a bat. I can't. I'm going to have to Google because I don't even know if there is any bat caves. I'm Ragnarok. All I remember is the the castle. You're all probably screaming at me right now, like, obviously there's this one. <laughs> Are you stupid? Do you even play Ark? <laughs> I forget stuff, okay? Um, all right. <laughs> anyway, I was gonna decorate this. Uh, I wanted. Um, I don't know if they have one of these. If we got enough to, to make one, you can have like some crystals and stuff from that, I believe. Let me just place this down for now. See what we can do. Uh, I believe we are going to add a, the Aberration decor mod as well, just so they do have some like stuff to place. Because yeah, there's not really, hmm, there's not really any cave stuff. I mean, there's rocks, which I guess are caves, but like no crystal and aberration looking stuff. Some coral. Um, where was the, what, is that the tree with the light? Should we get one of them? Can I make one of them? If it's small, I want it. Oh, it is a small one. Yay! Can we place that like just here? They have a little light tree for us. That's cute, just so I remember this is my house. <laughs> and then we can lay on here. Aww. Look at me all snuggled up with my Megalosaurus. He's a very hairy, scaly girlfriend. Just the way I like them, obviously. I'm not sure what my head... Is that meant to be a pillow? It looks like a bit of wood. <laughs> looks like I'm just laying on a bit of wood. All right, so we'll call it a day there. So that is us joining the cave tribe. Um, what's this? Blood shrine. 
I don't know what a blood shrine is. That's just joining the cave tribe. Um, so next episode we'll go out and um, probably get a Megalosaurus or a Megalania. And then after that I do want to get some bats and stuff. And then we do need to trade for some Spinosaurus. So we'll see what people want for that and stuff. So this is going to be a little different. And I'm sure in the coming weeks we'll move over to another tribe or something like that. And, you know, we'll just, we're will just we not going to hop from tribe to tribe all the way through. But I do want to experience most of them and see how they play out and stuff. <gasps> My hat glows eyes as well. That wasn't a sentence. My hat has glowing eyes. There we go. <gasps> So anyway guys, yeah, if you did enjoy the video at any point, don't forget to smash the thumbs up button, subscribe, ring the bell, leave notifications, and thanks for watching, I'll see you all in a bit.